Welcome everyone to another video and this one will be unboxing and installing the Elgato HD60 Pro into our PC through our PCI mini slot. So let's go. First things first, you're going to take off your case cover, tempered glass or metal frame case. I don't know, up to you with what you got. But regardless, you're going to locate your PCI mini slot and from there you're going to take off your expansion slot bay covers for the back and install it using the same screws that you took off the expansion bay covers. That way you won't have a problem with the HDMI in or HDMI out out of the back. And you can just plug everything in just fine. The one recommendation I would make is to just lie your PC a flat. Don't have it dangling like that. Um, it's just, I did it for the recording. Anyone wondering what the PCI mini slot looks like? There you have it, folks. Now there's no latch for the PCI mini slot, so you don't have to worry about getting it out of the whole system like you would have to do with the graphics cards and whatnot, or the RAM, likewise. After throwing the case cover back on, you will get the drivers on the PC as well as disable the HDCP on your system. So in the link in the description, you will be taken to the drivers download page. You will pick whatever you need exactly. I need the HD60 Pro, we need the HD60 Pro. From there, it will download, you will open it, it will ask for administrative properties. From there, I've already installed it, but I'll press OK, reinstall. From there, you are good to go on your PC, and now you need to disable the HDCP settings on your PlayStation. This is what enabled HDCP settings look like. Now on your PlayStation, you're gonna to go to settings, and then you're gonna to go to the bottom to system, and you are going to disable the enabled HDCP. If you have not disabled this, you will not have a signal pass through, and you'll just get a blank signal searching. Lastly, what we're gonna to wanna to do is set up our feeds and sources. So we're gonna go and make a new video capture device. We're going to Game Capture HD60 Pro. And from there, we are good to go. You can add all your other sources and whatnot. That's possible. So, have fun. Congrats. I'll see you in the next video. See you in the next one, folks.